YouTube solution for the suits for kicks. I'm back with another video. Make sure you comment, like, subscribe. Hopefully, I don't get clapped because of the music. But um, we're out here in Grapevine at the Nike clearance store. It's been a long time since I've been to a Nike clearance store. And uh, yeah, it's not it's not a lot so far from what I'm saying. But um, you know, we're dealing with COVID right now and everything. But I just saw a pair of sneakers that probably had something. So let's check it out. All right, I remember, I remember pictures of these coming out about a year or so ago. The Air, Mar Air Monarch 4, Martin, Martin Rose. Yeah, these, these are horrible, man. These are horrible. Oh my goodness. And they, they want $100 for these? Yeah, these are disgusting. Nine and a half. Like normally when you come to the clearance store, you find some crazy steals like we used to anyway. But I'm seeing a lot of these 200s with that Bordeaux look. This is an eight and a half. This is the wrong spot. This is the nine and a half spot. And they also got some horrible smelling hand sanitizer in here too. I mean, if you're, you need to get your workout on, do some running or something, they got you. Oh yeah, I earned these. Let me say what y'all want. If you haven't retired yet, just don't make jokes about it. Don't say nothing. I earned those. I mean, you got these, this is Air Max lights. That's about the only decent thing I've seen in here so far. You got these Reacts. Nah, of course I don't want them. Oh, I looked at the wrong colorway. You got these. That ain't bad, but that's not a need. Yeah. They got any um, retros in the back that I haven't put out? Nah. Oh, okay. If you're a Memphis Tigers fan, Phone positive action going on right here. That, this is actually a pretty cool sneaker. But, of course, I probably wouldn't wear these. You know, got the Air Penny joints for a hundred of those things. This would be something I definitely would buy and sell. What do you think? It's crazy. You crazy? Of course you can say that. It's a phone positive. <laughs> uh, I mean that's that's pretty much the steel. That's probably my thumbnail. You know. Matter of fact, let me let me go ahead and handle that right now. It's probably a little thumbnail action. Mm. They, they drop in here all the time? I come in here and get a lot of stuff. Yeah. Wow. Wow. And those on the show? Back there? Okay, cool. Appreciate it, man. $60, too. Show EXP. I remember pictures of those. Is 
Devin Wah. Like a SF? Yeah. Yeah. What we got here? What is going on here? Yeah. Kind of tactical one. Explore XX. $70. I mean, if you get a little fashion for it, I guess you could pull these off. You know? Where'd this come from? Right here. Send you back to which you came. <laughs> you probably would you would bought something like that before you met me. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh peak peaks. Six one. Look at that. Oh those are. Man, those are. Oh yeah. What we got here. I got a little uh nah, not South Beach, because that's purple. Everybody likes to call stuff South Beach. Those are dope though. Fifty-nine of them things. Wait, what are you implying? You want them? You want them? It don't matter to me. Yeah, Matt. That's hold on to them. This is stuff we go through. Man, look at this. Sixty. Sixty. I just saw them on the other side. Yeah, I paid full price for them. Yeah, these two. Look. Woo. Look at that price, man. Ugh. I ain't cheap, though, so, you know. She wanted them, so I got them. She already finessed me out of something already, y'all. Another pair of joints. Six and a half. I think I need those. Mine was like a five and a half. So that was the Nike outlet at Grapevine up here in the Dallas area. Grand Prairie, my bad. Grand Prairie. Wasn't um too much to see. A couple of interesting things. Alright y'all, we're at Grand Prairie. Now, I've been here before. Um, actually, I got 30% off in here. The clearance store did not have that. And um, I haven't really seen anything noteworthy. off on the wall excuse me pardon me man I tell you this, the lines waiting to get in here when you get inside you almost feel compelled to buy something <laughs> you have any um retros you haven't put out on the floor um no I think uh -huh. everything we got is gonna be out all right I know there's some ones. Uh -huh. the orange one. Oh, the I mids. Have the mid top. Okay. Yeah. Um, but I think the last six just disappeared. So okay. Somebody just bought the last six. So okay. I don't think we have any more of those. All right. So what, what six was it? What times were you looking for? The CSR is checking for a shoe that's not out on the floor, and actually, it's a, a sneaker that um I want it. And uh, I passed on a couple times. I didn't want to pay that retail price. So hopefully it's marked down already. And um, I get this 40% off the markdown as well. Like I said, you almost feel compelled to buy something when you're standing out there. Yeah, two lines going, two double lines. He said, you know, you get something. A word? For real? Y'all hear this? 
get yourself a keychain. <laughs> Yeah, somebody wore these. They laced them up already. Look at that. That's not from walking around in the store either. Yeah, they actually come with the green and blue laces in them already. So, you know, Nike has a very liberal return policy. Here we go. Finesse game in the stack, y'all. Hey, look, peep these out. You want those? No. I saw these in the uh, San Marcos outlet a long time. All right, y'all. So we're back at the house. Actually, I'm lying. Been back at the house for two weeks now. Uh, <laughs> yeah, now I am about these videos, y'all. But these are the sneakers that I asked the customer service rep to go to the back and see what he had. And um, at first, he told me, "You listen to the, you know, you remember in the video." If you remember the video, he says um, only thing he had was some Shadow Sixes or something like that. What was that the other one? All right. Well, he basically was, he said he had some Sixes back there, but it sounds like he didn't want to sell them. He didn't want to bring them out. Maybe a customer service rep had ideas for these. I'm not sure. So um, I didn't, I cut him off at that point because he tells me what exactly what the shoe is and I didn't want to blow it off for you all. So, it's a couple of sixes that came in this box. So you may not be certain, but you can kind of narrow it down exactly what six is. So the story of me with the sneaker was I loved the colorway, all right? I loved it, um, but I was not in love with the original price, which is covered up. And I want to say they, they were selling these at 220 or two, 200, one of those. Anyway, let's get into it. Nice Jordan paper there. And you can see it's the Jordan 6 Social Status, which released uh, early last year, if I'm not mistaken. The Social Status Collaboration, aka the Calfer. Um, I thought it was a dope sneaker with the materials and everything that were on it, but I was not happy with the price. And, um, you know, Jordan brands sometimes present sneakers as if they're limited and they're really not. And uh, for some reason, he's hung around for a second. Now, what could be wrong with this sneaker? And look, I'm already in, in color. I'm already in character with the hoodie and the hat. But let's talk about some things I wish they could improve. Um, it's not many. It's hard to find three. Um, I would I would like just maybe a little bit more purple here and there and stuff like that. But this is done well. All right, that, that's me nitpicking. Um, the Nike Air on the back, y'all know me. I really don't care about that. Um, this is a, a OG hype beast thing, right? I don't care. If the sneaker's well made, I'm fine with that. So if they put this on the back, they put the jump man on the back, I'm cool with it. It doesn't matter to me as long as I like the sneaker overall. Um, so really, this is a reach for me right here. I didn't care if they did that or not because it's black. I mean, you really got to get up to see that. Um, the, the icy soles, I told you all, I try to stay away from this, but it's done well. And you know what happens to this over time. It's going to age. It's going to turn yellow, and of course, this is purple and black. It's going to stand out. But those are reaches. This is a, a very cool sneaker. Um, if you did buy this for full retail at the time, you wanted the sneaker, and that's fine. All right, in this case, I stumbled upon it, but the best part about the sneaker really was the price. So I actually got this sneaker at 40% off, and the entire store was 30 Of course, you slap on a military discount in the store. It's 10%, so $159, 40% off, plus I had a um, $40 card in my account, my Nike account. So they added that on there as well. So you do the math of that. I really, really came up with this sneaker and um, it was a, a cool pickup. And it, it was, I was shocked to be in the clearance store, the first store we went to and not really find anything. I would have been copping for the sake of copping. Then we went to the actual Nike store and um, it was a grapevine. You know, we saw a few things there, but not much really to say, ooh, I gotta get those. I did like those Air Force Ones that the dude had. He came up with it, but he had some small feet. Those were seven and a half. So I wasn't gonna get that shoe, clearly. But drop down in the comments, let me know what you think. Long time since I did a, um, a vlog at the outlet and everything, um, especially on the road. That was like the first road trip in a very, very long time for me since COVID. 
And um, I was a little antsy about doing that anyway, but everything's cool, everything's fine. Um, you know, it's got to see some family members and everything. Um, but yeah. Oh, the other thing too, I forgot about this. They actually put leather on the interior. That That's dope. All right. That actually, that's a good look, y'all. If y'all haven't had a sneaker with some leather inside the shoe, it feels really good. All right. But Amadi, make sure you comment, like, subscribe, tap the notification button so you too can know when I'm dropping other of these things. And remember, it's not about how much you pay for the sneaker. It's why you pay that much. And Amadi, boom.